So here we are, the start of the painting. What I'll do is I'll include pictures instead of actual painting time. That way you guys don't get bored extremely to death. But um, this is the start. And what I'll do is I'll show all four sides. So here's this side. Here's this side. Here's this side. And of course, this side. So what I'll do is I will take pictures of uh, the different stages and show you the four sides like I just did with the addition of paint. And speaking of paint, uh, I'm going with a basic uh, color. It's not going to be anything different than the, what's in the game. And I'll include a photo here. That's what it looks like, and we'll see how close I can get. Okay, off to go base coat it. Just a note on the paints I'm going to use. After I've base coated it black, I chose my palette. I have red, black, white, uh, gray, green, and deep shader to shade it. Uh, the red is for the red, the black is for certain parts that need to be black and outlined, the white will be the white, uh, the gray mixed with black will be the dark gray and the lighter gray, or maybe that's for the strips on the blocks, the GSO blocks. The green will be um, mixed with the white to make lighter and lighter, you'll see, it'll be highlighting the uh, dial on the uh, batteries that are in the front. There's four sp spots that you can see. And I should say I'm going to add a blue for this digital screen, but I'm going to look and make sure that it's blue and not green. Anyhow, that's all the colors I'm actually going to use, although I might throw in, like I said, blue and silver. I'm using Army Painter paints. Uh, from the <laughs> zombie side uh, selection and uh, I really like their paints they mix well they go on well so we'll see anyhow uh, off to paint now that it's um, black <laughs> 